Hi Intune friends! In this video we're gonna set up to so we can enroll Mac OS and in the previous video we created an Apple ID. If you already have one, go along. If you don't have an Apple ID for this, go and see the previous video. So if we go here on the devices and we can go under Mac OS, and as you see I have no one here, that's gonna change later in this area. So Mac OS enrollment, we have to enable this first. So Apple MDM push certificate is a requirement. So let's click and we're going to have five steps here. The first one, pretty easy. We have to agree to this agreement. I of course suggest that you read all this. It's not that much. And then just click I agree. Now, the second step, we're going to need to download a CSR, a certificate signing request. So that's just going to be a file. So let's download this one. Yes, here, got that file. Now we need to create our Apple MDM push certificate. And there's more information here. There are a lot of uh, interesting information here. For example, it's only valid for one year and you don't really get a notification. So put in your calendar this date where you enable this and a week before put a reminder that you have to renew this one. If not, uh, you see very often on forum where people say, hey, it's been working great and now it doesn't work. One of the first... Uh, replies are usually hey have you checked that your certificate certificate hasn't expired and most of the time yes it has expired when people have that issue so let's create this one so we need to sign in so i'm actually going to use a different apple id i'm going to use the one that i created in the video previously and mine is called gbn apple id at uh, branch.cloud you use yours here of course I don't mind rem remember me and we created the password in the previous video I'm not going to share that and you shouldn't share yours either let's see if I did this correctly I did and I have a two factor I'm going to my mobile so let's see a message I got it here so it's uh, three zero one for me three four seven no you don't have to save that so now we're gonna create this certificate so you just click be sure that you're signed in with the, the ID you want to use and that you remember the password you're gonna need it when you renew this after a year Again, read all this, and I have read and agreed, definitely, I accept. So now we need to upload the file that we downloaded in step two, as you remember. See if it's still there. Yep, our CSR. Okay, so here's our CSR file. So let's, that's in my download folder, it's going to be on yours too. Uh, I'm going to sort this one, let's list, and here it is on the top, so it's in co called Intune CSR.CSR, so we upload this one, well, I've chosen the file, and now we upload it, when I click on upload, perfect, so we have done this part, so if we go back to Intune, we have now created our push uh, uh, certificate. Let's download that as well. So we can download it. And again, it's gonna go in our download folder and it's only valid one year. So for me, that's gonna be 2024. I need to put the notification. Okay, enter the Apple ID that you have been using. So I have been using GBN. Apple ID, it's not case sensitive, but I like it. Cloud, and here we have to take the MDM certificate that we just downloaded. So again, browse, and it's a PEM file. Okay, so all good. I do a quick recap. It, I went pretty fast, but I think you can follow. It's not that difficult, many steps. Just read and agree, then download the CSR. Then go here, log in with your Apple ID and upload the CSR. 
Then you create the certificate that you download. That's on step three that you download. It's the one that you upload here. And here you specify which Apple ID. So now let's click on upload and see if I've done any error here. It looks like it's success. So I'm going to close this one. I'm going to close this one. Now this lights up and this going to be probably next video. I can speak a bit about the enrollment methods before we end this video. So if you're an enterprise, you have really cool ways to upload. You can upload all your IDs and um, enroll easier. Unfortunately, I'm not a big enterprise. I'm the only employee on GBN Corporate and it's unclear actually what we are doing at this company. So um, I can only enroll as a personal device, but we're going to speak more about that in the next video. So we have enabled Apple MDM push certificate and that's great because as mentioned, not here, here. That is a requirement if we read this part here. An Apple MDM push certificate is required to manage Mac OS devices in Intune. So that step, well done. You have done that. And now we can go in the next video, we're actually gonna enroll a Mac. So thank you very much for following along this video. See you in the next video. Thank you very much.